In this video, I'd like to discuss avoiding operating on ice during surgery. And I'm specifically referring to the instruments that we use through the side part incision and how these instruments may inadvertently make contact with the speculum. And this metal on metal contact may cause an inadvertent slip outside the eye, which causes the instrument to slip inside the eye. And this is what I mean by operating on ice. Of course, operating on ice means a slippery state where someone can slip. Well, the same thing applies for our instrumentation. And so how can you avoid this? Well, number one is you can be strategic with where you place your paracentesis incision. So in this particular case, you could shift the paracentesis so that it's more 90 degrees away from the main incision and, and therefore away from the speculum. Number two is to make a mental note of where your instrument is relative to the speculum during your surgery. And number three is if you encounter this intraoperatively, instead of making another paracentesis incision away from the speculum, you can instead simply adjust your speculum and you can actually rotate the speculum away from where your instrumentation is. Now here I'm showing you contact with a angled cannula, but the same thing can happen with your chopper, where the chopper may inadvertently make contact with the speculum and that can affect how you chop uh, because of this slippery uh, 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 contact between these two surfaces. So I hope you found this video to be useful and thanks for your attention.